You know, one of the most difficult airplanes to get a, a shot at seeing is Pipistrel's new Panthera. The aircraft has been designed with a few goals in mind. It, was, it is supposed to be the most efficient four-seat uh, aircraft in the world. Uh, it uh, has to house, it has to be able to seat four people in comfort but, and still give full range, which is over 1,000 nautical miles. And those four people will zip along at 200 knots while the Lycoming IO390 will sip just 10 gallons an hour. So it has full range with four passengers. Pilot and passengers sit in a wide cabin. The Panthera uses a conventional control stick with direct push rods to the control surfaces. A unique knob controls trim in all axes, and the surface of the aircraft is as slick as can be. No hinges, nothing sticking out. It has been designed to house four people in comfort and then to pull uh, as tight a skin as possible over all the mechanicals to pack them nicely. This is what allows it to reach such performance figures uh, that other aircraft require much stronger engines uh, to achieve. It's an all composite construction with a Kevlar and carbon fiber roll cage protecting the occupants. Uh, the empty weight is 680 kilos and the maximum takeoff weight is 1,200 kilos. That's a little over 1,100 pounds useful load. 760 pounds of useful load with full fuel. So it's extremely lightweight and this is what allows us to reach these performance targets. The landing gear is made of super strong, super light titanium. Electric motors drive the gear and flaps. Pipistrel is planning electric versions of the Panthera as well. One hybrid, one fully battery powered. Cost, current cost of the experimental uh, factory assist build kit is 335,000 euro. Uh, and the certified version is expected to cost 395,000 euro. That's $521,000, not including air conditioning, for the Lycoming powered version. The prototype on display at Aero Friedrichshafen will start flying soon to verify all of the performance goals. That is what the computer says. We used CFD tools to predict the performance. So we did airfoil design. This is our own design. Uh, the whole wing is our own design. So. Uh, we used computer tools throughout, from the CFD analysis, finite elements to get the structure lightweight. And then, of course, the whole shape, all the components have been computer designed before they were built, so then using rapid prototyping techniques. In Friedrichshafen, Germany, Tom Horn, AOPA Live.